Hi, and welcome to Text Nation TV. This week, it's all about Black Friday ads. And some Black Thursday ads. We're going to tell you what to buy, what not to buy. And also, stay tuned for the end for a special unboxing of the Nest learning thermostat and installation. Hi, and welcome to Text Nation TV, episode number 56. This week, like we said, all Black Friday ads. We're filming this on Monday, so we're not going to be able to get everything to get you ready. Exactly. For so the shopping when experience. when this when this hits Thursday, you guys have got to be prepared. We've got all sorts of things for you. Alan and I have been back and forth with some of the ads, things like that. Target, Walmart, Best Buy, your big electronics places. We're not hitting any of your like local places, like Electronics Express. For yeah, us. we don't have a fries or anything. Yeah, like we're not, that. we're not going to have anything like that. So it's just going to be your big places. Um, I'm gonna let you start it off because I've got one that I'm gonna steal from CNET, so I'm gonna kind of steal some ideas from him. So, oh, all right. Well, to start off, TVs. Almost everybody is now offering at least ten TVs. And exactly. Yes. Yeah. Um, Walmart's got a, like two or three uh, doorbuster deals that I would look for. The main one is the Vizio 60-inch LED 1080p smart TV with Wi-Fi 688. This TV normally retails for almost a thousand dollars. Yeah, and, and that's going to be the big thing this year is the push for HD TVs because HD TVs have been around for quite a while, but they've been that seven hundred dollar to a thousand mm -hmm. and plus if you go up. So. Well, this one has Wi-Fi, so with Wi-Fi they have the Vizio apps, but you can get Netflix, Hulu, Plus, your, your basic, YouTube, yeah, 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 your basic video app. So that's going to be pretty cool. What else do um, they got? They've got a Samsung thirty-two inch for two forty-eight, which is a good deal. It's a only 720, but still, you really have to yeah. know the difference between 1080 and 720. Maybe a Blu-ray, you could see the difference. Yeah, in that, but yeah. for but for 248, I would wait in line for that one. Also, another Samsung 43-inch plasma, which I still have a plasma TV, and I think it looks better than my LED. Yeah, for 378. Yeah. So those three TVs, I would definitely uh, wait in line for. Okay, so we've got some Emersons in there in the list as well. You guys can definitely go to the. I think it's what BlackFriday.com, uh, BFAds.net. I mean, there's all sorts of this where you can pull up everything. So this is just where we're getting Black Friday. Yeah, yeah, this is pretty much where we're getting up. everything. But we just want to hit some of the big ones. Uh, for instance, Kmart. Uh, They're still open. I know that's surprising to me. Kmart is selling a Pro Scan. Now I've never heard of the company. I know nothing about this company. I know that they're for sale on Tiger Direct based upon the ad that I was reading, mm -hmm. uh, and there's some good reviews, but it's a 50-inch HD TV. It's LCD instead of LED, so it's still going to be kind of thick, yeah. it's, but it's 50 inches, and it's $288. That's sub-300 plus tax. So, I mean, you're looking for at... For a 50-inch. Right, yeah, for a 50-inch TV. So, for those of you looking to go low budget, you, you don't want to go, you know, the full 688 for the 60-inch, you know, this may be the line that you want to go. You know, get that 288. Why, why? Uh, it does not have Wi-Fi. It's just a basic 60 hertz. Uh, the one that you were talking about was 120 hertz. Yeah. So that has a faster refresh rate. Uh, look up refresh rate. That kind of gets technical. It's, it's basically how fast the uh, lines are getting refreshed across the screen. Has three HDMI inputs on it, so it's nothing as you know. I've got four. Yeah, exactly. Nothing is as spectacular coming from Walmart. But if you don't have the 688 dollars, go this way. Go to Kmart. Check it out. Um, they've got uh, also. On this list as well, the same thing, that same 60 inch for 688 plus tax. Um, and what's funny is it was just last month that that TV debuted at $999.99. So, yeah, just less than a month yeah. later, it's going down. Best Buy also uh, TVs there as well. Toshiba, LG, Panasonic, names you know. Yeah. Make sure to check those out. Um, we'll some here. Uh, LG 27 inch LED uh, flat, $199. This is a one of those really flat ones that yeah. uh, look like picture frames, basically. Um, Panasonic 32 inch, 189. So base, uh, 40 inch Toshiba, 179. So under 200 bucks, you can get a decent sized television. Yeah, and, and I really think it's going to be the year for flat screens because not only is are they is uh, Best Buy doing the Black Friday ads, they're also doing the countdown to Thanksgiving. Uh, so they started with Sunday, and today being Monday, they've got a RCA. Not a you know big name as much anymore, but they've got the 46 inch LCD 1080p 60 hertz HD TV. So not a bad. It's still gonna have that bezel around the sides. It's not gonna be LED with a nice thin bezel, but four HDMI inputs, two eight watt speakers. We got PC video input, USB port. 
doesn't have Wi-Fi, anything like that. It's just a big monitor. It's $349 for just for today. But as you see the days pass on, you can check out the Best Buy website and see countdown to Thanksgiving and see different deals yeah. every single day. Store you can pass for TVs. Target. They've got an Apex. <laughs> 32 inch for 147. Um, skip on it. Uh, just uh, stand in line at Best Buy. Also, Best Buy's got a 55 inch Panasonic 3D. If you're into the 3D for 899, which that TV was well over 1200 dollars last year. Yeah, and I mean you're even looking at Amazon as well. They've got some Toshiba uh, TVs for 100. Here's one 179 dollars. That is a 40 inch LCD 1080p 60 hertz, not 120 hertz like the other ones. Yeah. Uh, but still. For sub two hundred dollars, getting a forty inch flat screen TV, that is awesome. So I really don't think anybody at this point, past twenty thirteen, should have an old CRT, you know, <laughs> television. I mean, my neighbors who just invited me down for dinner the other day, I went down and I saw a CRT TV, and I was like, "Really? It's twenty twelve? Come on, guys! They're let's hope they watch." Yeah. So I'm just saying, get there and get you a good TV. Uh, get out there and get you a good TV. Bring you a big car. Yeah. There's, there's going to be a lot of these big boxes out there that and you pull up in your Escort, it's just not going to happen. <laughs> so let's get away from TVs. Obvious, yeah, let's get into tablets, things like that. Um, obviously, I just want to say off on the side, I have seen enough of the Microsoft Surface. It's out there. I get it. I see it. I just don't want to buy it just yet. Anybody offering the Surface that you've seen? I haven't. I, I haven't seen a deal on it. Yet. I haven't seen a deal on it yet, but uh, Target here, for instance, has got the Nook Simple Touch e-reader for forty nine dollars. It's an e-reader. It's not an actual tablet, but it's an e-reader. So that's something to get you out there uh, and get into Target. Make sure you get that. Uh, what else you got? Well, speaking of the Nook, Walmart has a Nook as well for ninety nine. So it'd be better to go to Target if you're wanting that Nook tablet. Yeah. Walmart has the Apple iPad two. Which we know we're up to four now, but yeah. I still have an iPad 2 and have no problems with still it. Still running yeah. strong. 16 gig Wi-Fi, also $75 gift card with that. So for $399, you get the iPad 2 with the $75 gift card. Also, Walmart's offering this year a guarantee. They guarantee it in stock, even if it's not in stock. If they happen to run out of stock, you can get a what they call a guarantee card, and you can still... Purchase that item at that price well before Christmas. So if I were to open them, my box up, and I don't have an iPad, but I open up the box and I get a gift card, it's still going to be able to, I can still go to the store and pick up that iPad. That's awesome. Yeah. I like that. Um, also, and this is one we were discussing just before we got Walmart as well, iPad 4, mm -hmm. um, they're going to be doing, and I think it's a misprint, but you seem to think it's not, and we're kind of back and forth well, on this. It's on Walmart's site right now, and it's really the best deal out there. You can do this, to, looks like today. It, it, kind of what it looks like, but it, it says Apple iPad 4 Wi-Fi choose 1632 or 64 with bonus accessory kit. So th there's no 16 gig, here's your price, yeah. 32, here's your It says choose. 499 for any. That's... So why yeah. would you not get a 64? Yeah, exactly. So, I, I mean, that looks like the way to go. And that's $100 more than, just only $100 more than the iPad 2. Yeah. So, I, I seriously think uh, Walmart should uh, be stocking up on these iPads, I hope. Yeah. Uh, they're the Wi-Fi versions. They're not the LTE versions. So, for those of you looking for the LTE versions, you're going to have to go to your uh, carriers, AT&T, Verizon, Sprint. Speaking of which, if you watched last week, AT&T now offering $100 off. Yeah, with the two-year contract. Same thing with uh, Best Buy. If you take in your old laptop, uh, you will get $100 off if you bring in an old working laptop. So if we took this hunk of junk right here and brought it into Best Buy, I could get $100 for it. Hunk of junk. Yes. <laughs> I say that because this is not my book. It's his, and I want to clarify episode, that. Every episode he says that, but he's, he, it's there in front of him every <laughs> week. Like I said, he, this is just like his side apartment where he keeps, you know... Uh, the PC can't know that he's got a Mac on the side. <laughs> there is, though, also the iPad 3 also at Walmart. Same thing. Uh, but what I don't get, though, is it says 1632 or 64 from 679. And it says from yeah. 679. So I'm assuming this may... Also as an or. Yeah, and I, I, something tells me that this may be the leftover stock for the iPad 3 and they maybe can't, you know, finagle. I don't know. We'll see what actually happens on Black Friday as far as uh, the uh, tablets are concerned. So we've got TVs. We've got tablets. What else do we need to hit up? Memory seems to be a really big, uh, right? 
between Option. memory and uh, sticks uh, and SD cards. Uh, uh, external hard drives. Um, yeah. Walmart's got some pretty good deals. Um, SD, 8 gig, 497. Wow, because I just, let's see, just the other day I sent you this link that Amazon had a 32 gigabyte SD card that I bought for sixteen ninety nine. dollars mm -hmm. I actually got two of them, so I you know, did the $35 or $34, whatever it was, for two of those. So I got two SD cards heading on the way, hopefully here sometime between now and then. So <laughs> we'll see about that. Um, also, uh, looks like Office Max has got a, get this, two terabyte uh, by Turo Desk. It's a, it's a two terabyte USB 3.0 hard drive for $64.99 plus tax. So really good deal because it's USB 3. For those of you that don't know, that just means super fast transfers. Whenever And for me, it's great because I edit all our videos. And so that transfer between the hard drives and things like that. How much was that? Uh, $64.99. That's the best deal because there's a terabyte hard drive at Walmart for $59. Well, so this, is a, this is a two terabyte hard drive. That's what I'm saying. That's the best deal. Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, you spend yeah. a little more and just get yeah, two terabytes. Exactly. And it's made by Western Digital. Uh, it's not Western Digital directly, but it's H HGST Turo, so they're a sub yeah. company, so it's like an umbrella, but anyway. Best Buy is selling Seagates, uh, one terabyte for 69, three terabyte for 99. Which, which isn't bad, because three terabytes are starting to become the norm. Mm -hmm. uh, it used to be two terabyte, now three is. Uh, they do make six and four, just not as prevalent, a little bit more expensive. Uh, things like that. Um, and getting away from hard drives, but back down to like flash drives, uh, Radio Shack has got a SanDisk. Everybody knows SanDisk, the little, you know, quick, you know, mini USB things. Yeah. 32 gigs for $9.99 plus tax. So that seems like it's going to be awesome. Uh, Radio Shack may be a great place to hit up as well. Um, I mean, that 32 gig hard drive over the last few months has been like $17. So it's like $8 off, basically. And it's keychain friendly. I mean, everybody carries them on their keychain. Also, the 64 gig flash drive, Office Max $25, Best Buy $28, Office Depot $30. So we're looking at somewhere between $25 and $30. You can get yourself a 64 yeah, these, gig. Yeah, these prices weren't unheard, were unheard of last year. Yeah. Um, there's a lot of things out there. We've covered TVs, we've covered hard drives, we've covered SD, USB flash drives, things like that. Obviously, there's other things out there that you guys may want to buy, but this is a tech show. We want to talk electronics, and that's pretty much what we've got here for you. So, yeah, you can never have too many, too much memory. Yeah, exactly. Especially in what we do. Yeah, we've been out, I guess, on the field, and <laughs> the SD cards filled up. Yeah, we've got to bring, forgot to bring more, and that's yeah. the reason why I bought the two that I bought. So exactly. that we, you know, so be prepared out there. Bring a big car because you're going to buy a big TV. You can bring the Tech Nation mobile car if you'd like. Just call them up. <laughs> yeah, for a fee, uh, yeah, for a fee, I'll show up, why not? <laughs> but uh, yeah, so we've got tablets in there. Uh, I'm going to say, what's what's going to be your pick that's going to get you up? And, and let, let's talk about this real quick, because some of these places are open at different times. Uh, we've got Target opening at 9, nine on p. Thursday. Thursday night. Walmart, 10 o'clock Thursday yeah. night. Uh, the Best Buy is going to be midnight. Midnight, yeah. Uh, and I read with the Kmart ad, they were supposed to be opening at 8 p.m. on Thursday night. So it's Sears. Yeah, and I, and I find this kind of odd because I think it's, you know, retail just pushing that limit just to see how far back can we go. Because like you said, it's no longer Black Friday. It's Black Thursday now. You know, how can we, you know, get yeah. this a little bit more? I kind of like uh, Macy's po uh, shop there a lot, but they posted a photo on their Facebook page where it says that, we will be closed on Thanksgiving yeah. through Thanksgiving night because we believe that employees should be with their family. Yeah, so uh, for... I, I thought it was really cool, you know, even though I don't shop there, but, you know, that they're taking a stand. Yeah. We all don't want to eat turkey <laughs> and then have that, whatever that chemical is in you, and trying to think and make a list <laughs> and argue with your family. You may want to get, you may want to get away from your family. Then we can understand that, but... <laughs> Yeah, so for those of you, if you are working Thursday, I hope that it is volunteer, because if it were me, I'm not big in the family. I would volunteer to work. It doesn't bother me I'm a bit. I'm big in the shopping. <laughs> but uh, if you are working Thursday, I just hope that you get to spend time with your family beforehand. Please, you know, spend time with friends, family, whatever it is that you do. Please don't go out and wear yourself out and try to do all that. But uh, for those of you not working, you know, we've given you what we think is the best well, well I didn't, we didn't say best. What's what's going to be your pick, the, the one thing you want to go out and get and you have to have? Not that you're going to. I'm just saying, what's the one thing, if you were going to, this is your thing, this is what it's going to be, what is it going to be? Um, 
Actually, it was quite a bit as looking looking through the list and everything. Well, top three. Uh, Go with top three. Top three? Yeah. All right, let's do TVs. Okay. Top three TV. Um, at 16 inch Wi Fi is tempting. Right. But divorce payments would probably, would probably be a lot more. Exactly. I could sit out in the road with my Wi Fi TV if <laughs> my wife lets me be in range of our Wi Fi Exactly, seat. exactly. So maybe that, that could work. Um, the tablet. Yeah, I'm thinking the uh, iPad Four for. I mean, if you can choose up to 64 for 4.99, right? That's the way to go. I've got an iPad too. Yeah, you know, big deal. It comes with a 75 dollars gift card. You know, yeah, for yeah. 100 bucks more. You know, I could do that and exactly probably still sell on the side for a little more. <laughs> um, and just this memory, you know. Yeah, I mean, you can get eight gigs for five bucks. I'm gonna I'm gonna say my my top two that want to get me out are gonna be the 64 gig uh, flash drives for in between 25 and 30 dollars. Mm -hmm. uh, those are obviously things you always need. You never have enough memory. And then my number number one is gonna be that iPad. If if it is true that it's 499 for 16, 32, or 64, mm -hmm. I'm gonna say yeah, 499 for that i the most brand new iPad if they can have it in stock. There's no guarantee on the iPad 4. There is the 2. Yeah. Make sure we clarify that. Uh, but if, if I can get my hands on an iPad 4, I, I may have to do that. So I may be out, you know, that night because I'm off Thursday and Friday. So I don't know what your schedule is, but I, you know, I may may be doing that. So we've got that covered. Uh, make sure again, guys, you follow us anywhere and everywhere. We are TextNation.tv. You see all of our videos at YouTube.com/slash TV. You can like us on Facebook, facebook.com slash TV. All the tech news you can use on our Twitter feed, twitter.com slash TV, Which spills over into our Google Plus, gplus.to slash TV. Have a great holiday and stay tuned for the unboxing of my assistant, The Nest. <laughs>